The Globe reporting Tom Brady's trainer, Alex Guerrero, has had various team privileges stripped. Basically, he's not on the charter anymore, not on the sideline anymore. There have been rumors of friction between Guerrero and the team for a couple of years. So why is this happening now? After more than a dozen interviews with New England Patriots staffers, players, and executives with knowledge of the team's inner workings, it's become clear that tensions between Tom Brady and Bill Belichick are threatening to fracture the Patriots dynasty. One trigger for these tensions, Brady's trainer and business partner, Alex Guerrero. I'm so fortunate to have him not only as a friend, but everything that we've been able to do together. And Alex has been a huge, huge reason why you know, I'm still playing. As his access increased at Patriots headquarters in recent years, Guerrero and his TB12 alternative treatments have been a growing source of friction. Many players, especially newer ones, felt pressure to take part in TB12. It boiled over this fall when Belichick heard players asking themselves and each other, do we risk alienating the NFL's most powerful coach or risk alienating the NFL's most powerful quarterback? In December, the Boston Globe reported that Belichick had limited Guerrero's previously unfettered access, saying that Guerrero wasn't a team employee, but he allowed Guerrero to continue working with players who sought him out. How did you react when Bill told you that he was going to do that? Uh, I don't really agree with your question, so I don't know what you're talking about. How do you know what he said? Look, we have a lot of people that work for our team outside of the team. So I'm not going to go through a case by case of what everybody does. That would be impossible to do and I'm not going to do it. Another fault line, Brady's desire to play into his mid forties versus Belichick's plan to groom Jimmy Garoppolo as an eventual replacement. I was in an event with Tom Brady when they drafted Jimmy Garoppolo and he walked up to me as a coach. I don't know why they're doing that. I plan on playing until I'm about 45. Brady saw Garoppolo as a threat. Belichick saw Garoppolo as the future. High-level meetings resulted in a mandate from owner Robert Kraft. Trade Garoppolo. The New England Patriots have traded quarterback Jimmy Garoppolo. It is all on Brady for the foreseeable future. According to his friends, Belichick was furious. But in the end, he did what was asked. Brady seemed liberated. His new backup, Brian Hoyer, is no risk to Brady's starting job. As one team staffer said of Brady, he won. And the Patriots will head to the postseason with another first round bye. They have clinched the number one seed as well. The Patriots are still the Super Bowl favorite, but they are in uncharted territory now. There's a sense in Foxborough that this year or next will be the last run for Brady and Belichick. Of all the ironies about the Patriot way, the biggest one is that a philosophy based on team only really needed two men to thrive. That's why it will be impossible to replicate should either of those men leave.